when I was growing up, it was not it was not like you know to leave girls out or it wasn't mm -hmm. malicious or anything. But you know, my my grandpa, my uncles, and my cousins like they taught me and my other cousins how to shoot. You know, the girls, but we didn't like go with them when they yeah. went out on their on their excursions. We didn't go hunting with them. Like we would see it and we would like help prepare it when it came back. And we knew how to operate a firearm and knew how to do all of this, but we didn't. We never went it's with them. It's changed now. Though. It it's has even changed. just being here at Shock Show. It's incredible. I mean, yesterday I was on a panel at the Under Armour booth, and there's, for the first time ever, there's a women's Under Armour hunt team, and there's, I think there's probably 12 or 13 of us, all girls That's like awesome. our age, out there. A lot of them are bow hunters, all very independent, strong women. It's cool. I mean, there was no men on the whole team with us. We were on the panel talking about hunting, and I can talk for days about hunting, and so can those girls, and it's. 20 years ago or 10 years ago or five years ago, I don't know that that many girls could even get in together and have the same passions right. and share their love for hunting. Right, and when it's so great to see, and it's, it's really, I mean, especially with bow hunting too, because as I was telling you, it's, it is, I don't know how to put it, it's just so much more personal, mm -hmm. and you really find out, I think, what you're made of when you're out there with a bow, when you're I, bow hunting, you and then really. Once you start going on hunts, like elk hunts with the bow, I was in elk hunt in Utah. So on top I've of- I've seen some of your kills, top, they're amazing. On top of the actual challenge of shooting a bow is you have to be in shape enough to get up those mountains. And yep. the second you see an elk, and if you're, sometimes it happens really fast, you have to get your breath back and be able to pull yourself back into the moment right. and be ready to take a shot. And instead of being doubled over, like deep breathing. And exactly. Having to wait, because you might miss the opportunity. And that's, that's, part of why I love hunting because it's yeah. such a challenge.